a professional welder with a user-friendly interface packed with features that you need for superior welds on steel, stainless, and aluminum at a fraction of the price of competitors. That is the TIG 200 LCD. Let's check out this machine. This machine operates on 120 volts or 240 volts and can weld from 10 to 200 amps, making it great for welding steel and aluminum from thin sheet metal all the way up to quarter inch on 240 volts or 1 8 inch thick on 120 volts. The high frequency start will give you the precise arc control and the square wave inverter will provide accurate aluminum welding. It has a WP17 flex head style torch that allows you to get the torch at the precise angle you need for the best welds possible. This torch comes with a gas lens kit to improve your shielding gas coverage. Plus, because it's a WP17 style type torch, it accepts common cups and collets so you'll be able to get your consumables at Eastwood or most welding supply stores. When you're welding with this thing, you can use the trigger on the torch or for more precise amperage control, switch to the rocker style foot pedal, giving you the heat control you need to make quality welds. The duty cycle is 20% at the full 200 amps on both AC and DC. Plenty to keep you welding, whether it's steel, stainless, or aluminum. This machine even has a pulse welding feature on both AC and DC, allowing you to further control your heat, which will help prevent burn through while giving you really nice clean welds. It's really helpful for aluminum and thin sheet metal, or if you're doing some more advanced movements like walking the cup. It even includes 2T and 4T modes. You will get repeatable, professional results every time. 2T is normal operation. Engage your arc with the pedal or trigger, complete your weld, and release. Two touches. 4T is like cruise control. Engage your trigger to start an arc and then release it, and it will ramp up to your welding amperage. Complete your weld, and when you're ready to terminate the arc, hit your pedal or trigger again, and your amperage will ramp down. Release the trigger, and it will terminate the arc. Four touches. Lastly, there's an option for five fully programmable presets. So if you're welding the same materials every day, you can set these up to easily switch back and forth between the settings. This machine has a pre-flow that you can set from zero to 10 seconds and a post-flow you can set from zero to 15 seconds. The LCD TIG 200 comes with a gas flow meter and hose, as well as a long nine and a half foot ground cable and an even longer 12 foot TIG torch cable. So moving around your project is nice and easy. With the flip of a switch, you can even stick weld, giving you the versatility you need when you're fabricating, restoring your car, or just doing repairs around the house and the garage. Now we talked a lot about the features, but let's show you how easy this thing is to set up for DC welding and show you some of the settings. With the machine powered on, you can navigate between the operations using the scroll wheel. I'm gonna select DC TIG since we wanna weld some mild steel. Now it gives you the option for 2T, 4T, or the foot pedal. I'm gonna be using the foot pedal today. Click the wheel to move forward. It may look like a lot of options, but setting this up is pretty straightforward, especially for the foot pedal option, because we only really need to reference pre-flow, peak amperage, and post-flow for a basic foot pedal operation. Don't worry though, we will have another video that explains how to use everything shown. First, let's set our pre-flow, which is the amount of time gas will flow from the torch after your initial press of the foot pedal, but before the arc strikes. Let's set this to 0.6 seconds. Now let's move over to peak amperage which is the highest amperage the machine will put out when the pedal is fully depressed. We're gonna set this to 150 amps. Lastly, let's set the post flow, which is the amount of time gas will flow from the torch after the arc has been terminated. Now you're all set to go ahead and complete your weld using the foot pedal. TIG welding really isn't that difficult to pick up, and this machine gives you all the professional controls you want in an easy to use welder. Whether you're a beginner or someone who has a lot more experience, you can check out the Eastwood YouTube channel for a bunch of videos that go from the basics to advanced TIG welding techniques, as well as more videos on all the features of this machine. Click the button to visit eastwood.com and get yours today.